hi guys welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for tuning in today in today's video the title of the video is how to truly be confident if you've ever seen one of these people that they're just confident no matter what no matter what they're wearing no matter what they look like no matter what comes their way they are always confident if you've been scouring to the internet watching videos about how to truly be confident and yet you're here in my video then I'm going to teach you how to be confident so you never have to watch another one of these videos ever again. But stick to the end of this one and like and subscribe. The definition of confidence is a feeling of trust in something or in someone. And that brings me to my first tip, which is stop trying to be confident in yourself. Stop trying to be confident in your looks. Stop trying to be confident in your source. So trying to be confident in your ability because it doesn't matter you should have confidence in god because ultimately it's god who is infallible it's god that's able to help you out of any situation you might be in so it's important to know that you by yourself you can't do everything for yourself you depend on other people most importantly and you depend on god so stop trying to be confident in yourself and in your abilities because it just doesn't matter so being confident in the fact that god is good and he's a good god that means he gives good things and also being confident in the fact that he has created a good world and he wants to give you good things that's what you should be confident in not in yourself and not in your abilities because that just doesn't work i can't give myself everything i want so there's no need for me to confident in myself i should be confident in something that can give me everything i want something that is not fallible and something that doesn't have any fault so the first point or my first point is to stop trying to be confident by yourself in yourself it won't work you should be confident in god who is infallible and who is good and who wants to give you good thing now the second way to be more confident in yourself is to look and feel your best now i know that there's so many different opinions on what your best is or what it looks like but we are so different and each one of us none of us is the same the seven or eight billion of us on this planet earth none of us is the same so i implore you to look for things that will make you feel your best now if you're looking for scientifically backed you know research on beauty and attractiveness i love 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 the channel called coves studio it's spelled q o v e s studio and they're here on youtube they make amazing content on physical attractiveness on facial proportions on makeup on hair on things that you can apply to your personal life or to your personal self that will help you improve your appearance that is backed by scientific facts there's another channel on this youtube it's called ali art studio she makes content on how to dress for your body shape and your body type so do make sure you check her out so that you can have science you know be backed by science when you know that you look good for yourself and in yourself it helps it relates in the way you relate to other people because you're not threatened by other people you're not threatened by how they look or what they have because you know that what you have is best suited to you and it's best suited to yourself and you can put your best foot forward when you're presenting yourself whether that be at work when you're giving a presentation or even with your peers or at a party knowing that you look your best can make you feel your best and also relate to others in a more confident way third tip to being confident is to be mindful of your posture and to be mindful of the words you say you should stop using filler words and actually improve your vocabulary and always portray what you want to say don't put lol laughing emoji or don't try to laugh serious things off or things that are serious to you so maintain a confident posture say what you mean and improve your vocabulary so that you can be more confident i cannot stress enough how much 
perception is to other people people can really see what's on the inside of you they see you the way you present yourself so image is very very important and the best way to convey convey that is during conversation with other people and during interaction with other people another important tip i have on how to be more confident in yourself is to find your purpose in life and get busy fulfilling it now i know that many people have many different theories on how to find your purpose in life or what's the purpose of life or what's the point of life but i'll just give you a tip now your purpose is most likely linked to helping other people because the reason we're put on this earth ultimately to live with other people that's the point just to live and to live in community with other people so your purpose would be how you live to help other people so finding a purpose and getting busy fulfilling your purpose not only makes you more attractive to others but it also takes the focus away from yourself and focusing on your flaws and what's not right about you and it pushes your focus outwards towards the world and towards towards things that really 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 matter not just your flaws or your physical or whatnot so finding your purpose whatever that might be for some people their focus might be you know raising a godly home or for some people their purpose might be healing cancer in children maybe functioning as a doctor for some people their purpose is even fulfilling you know working at a fast food and feeding other people for some people their purpose is fulfilling amazon orders so it doesn't matter whatever means you choose but your purpose in life is going to be connected to helping other people so immersing yourself into that activity that makes you function as a part of this world is going to help you to be more confident because when you are helped just think about when you help other people or how you feel when you've done something good for other people whatever that looks like for you whatever your occupation is what in whatever capacity you can function do it well and doing it well will help you to be more confident in yourself another really important way or means or how to be really 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 confident is to abolish shame i cannot begin to explain how much shame we all carry as a collective that is just insane for example most people find it cringe to post on instagram like why do you i need you to examine why do you find it cringe to post on instagram most people don't want to be seen like putting in a job application because they feel shameful for doing so the way shame shows up in our lives that makes us not to show up authentically as ourselves that makes us to go for less than what we deserve that makes us not to go for opportunities that we would otherwise be well qualified for that would make us not to reach out to that person that girl or that guy because we feel like we don't want to text first and be seen to be vulnerable so that's something that is really really important and i'm going to link a resource it's called the be known podcast they had a season where they talked about the soul of shame it's also a book so they did a really long analysis of the book and i would advise everyone to give the podcast a listen but they basically talked about how abolishing shame is what would enable you to show up authentically as yourself if that makes any sense and you need to show up authentically as, as yourself to be more confident in yourself if you know what i mean so yeah i don't want to talk too much check out the podcast and if you can also check out the book so that's it for this video guys thank you very 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 much for watching don't forget to give a thumbs up like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video